Putting the combined pill in the same group as tobacco or asbestos makes it sound scary, but what does it actually mean? See, that World Health Organization grouping is actually based on how strong the evidence is that that particular thing is linked to causing cancer. So also in that group include things like processed meats and ultraviolet radiation. So yes, to make it into that group, the combined pill can increase the risk of breast cancer and weaker evidence for cervical cancer as well, but that isn't all the story. I say that because it's also linked with a reduced risk of ovarian and endometrial cancer as well. And the studies show that after stopping using the combined pill, within 10 years, the risk of breast and cervical cancer reduces to those who have never taken the pill before. So yes, I'm disappointed to see their posts spreading fear, but we also need to do a better job counseling our patients about this. 